All right, if you're joining us now on center court for the first time, this is game number one between Max Shah from Canada and Marco Menagerak from Canada, two Canadians. At the moment, Mark, Marco has a uh, three to zero lead here. Forced error on the serve there. Marco's not liking that. So that brings it to 3-3. Three, three. Max, the number eight seed in Canada, and Marco, number 13 for this tournament. Max serving 4-3. Very nice loop there to bring it to 5 4. Wow, what a rally. Marco puts it in uh, Robo Pong mood there. This is three or four consecutive loop drives to win the point. Scores now 5 5, game one. Boom. Oh, what a return. Amazing. I think everybody thought that one was in the bank, and then boom, there it goes right back on the table. Game point here for Max Shaw. Let's see if he can deliver. 
And a miss by Marco gives him gives Max the first game. Eleven to eight. Shaw serving for game two. It's the first point. Oh, the net dribbler. He saw the net and went for it. Ah, just kidding. But that does give him a... Uh, of a psychological advantage of nothing else. There we have two to one, Max. Game two. miss on that shot. Four to two. Max Shaw over Mark. Marco. Majurdrak out of Canada. Marco is the number 13 seed and uh, in this group, in this tournament, and Max is number eight. Put that one away. You can't give that one to Marco. He's going to loop drive it every time. Very nice.
So Max Shaw 10 to 6 <clears throat> in this second game here. Let's see if he can close this game out. And he does. Two games to nothing, Max. Game three is one to one. Marco Majurgrak versus Max Shah, both from Canada. going downtown when it's that high. Can't give those to Marco. Oh, another good one by Marco. Give, you got to give Max Shaw credit, though. I mean, he's two games ahead, and he has successfully been able to control the pace of the match. That's why he's winning, and it's just a very calculated, smart play. Doesn't take unnecessary risks. Good serves. Again, it's just smart table tennis from uh, bottom, to, bottom to top here. However, in this game, he's struggling a little bit here. rally amongst these two players here. Third game action, six to five. Five serving six, I should say. Max Shaw to serve. Yeah. Oh, how about that? Max puts forth a winner, and then here it comes back. Marco gets the, uh, the block drive right down to the center of the table. Nice reflexes. Okay, Max 
Joseph gets that point there. Inching back closer and closer. Seven serving six for Marco. Oh, couldn't quite do it. Again, just consistent play. He, you know, Max is keeping it going, keeping it in play, not taking unnecessary risks. That's what he's got to keep doing. Keep applying the pressure. There it is, eight to eight. Third game. What a shot by Max. I, I thought Marco had that one in the bank, but uh, somehow Max Shaw pulled that one out. Amazing shot. I'll well, give Marco Majurka credit. I mean, that was a... Um, Amazing, again, forehand rally. That's his strength. He, he thrives for using the forehand loop drive. That's his biggest weapon. And it paid off that time. 9-9, nine, nine, game three. Game point for Marco if he can capture this point. This is absolutely critical to him to stay alive in this match. And there it is. He gets the game. Comes back from uh, the brink of match defeat and stays alive. He's down one game to two. Stay tuned, we'll be right back.
Okay, if you're joining us, we're in game four here of this match between Marco Medjorak out of Canada, number 13 seed in this tournament, and Max Shaw, number eight seed from Canada as well. Max is up two games to one, and he has a three to one lead in this, in this particular game. Just blitz that one right by. No room for error on that 100 mile an hour smash. Oh, what a shot by Max with the Thor tie. Six to three, game four. That's what he needs to do is just be a little bit more aggressive, you know, because, you know, Marco's is sitting there just going all out on these shots and, you know, consistency works on most of it, but you have to take it to Marco. You can't just get it back to him and help him just to sit down and not do anything. He's going to go after every shot, especially with the forehand. And as you see, Marco's creeping back five to six in game four. It is. You can't leave it high. He's going to do that all day long. Six to six. Seven seven, game four. Wow, what a rally! Very nicely played by both players. You can see Max making a concentrated effort to move Marco around. He doesn't want to give him the opportunity to sit there and unload a forehand loop in the same spot over and over and over again. He just won't miss. So he moves him around, tries to keep him off balance. Yeah, see that one wasn't quite there. Seven. 
game and match point on the line here. Can Max Shaw pull this out? One more point. Shaw wins the match.